So what happened is 200 was stolen from my bank account. And then it was 260. And I checked right before the day of my runway show. And I would have made it on time. Right before I went into Nordstrom, I checked and they said, you have 220 or something. It was over 200. And then the card did not work at Nordstrom. And then it happened again when my mom added 260. And then my checks from 40 jobs were stolen. So I wasn't paid for a whole three year period. And then it was four years for 40 jobs. And it was once a month, but it was a magazine every weekend. And it was still getting exploited with castings, but they reject the party promoting and prostitution clients for less than an agency rate. And they've done that for 20 years. And so what it is, is they follow through with an agency contract for 20 years. And then it happened where all the checks were stolen. And so I'm owed the money according to federal law for the 80,000 per job. And so are the other models because they booked it out of 140,000 people when it's replaced by a roster 2007. So they had to have the highest paid resume in order to be signed with commercials and theatrical and book the model talent jobs. So they booked the most amount of anti-slave trade campaigns and then commercials. And then that's how they booked the Hawker role as a direct booking with A-list productions or the speaking line to a celebrity for theatrical. And they support the government and the top percentage. And so what happened was the checks were stolen and they would have to have the 5k in a bank account but they'd have to be set up with a $400 per month rent because people were prostitutes for a waitressing job city to suburbia since 2007 but really since year 2000 and they rejected those jobs and it's the healthcare it's actually LGBT rights porn stars for the healthcare and so it's slave trade satanic productions and they said no to that that's why I'm the highest paid modeling agency owner with model agents owning the modeling agencies for slave trade and it's international. So it's separate where the 20 year Ford models who won for their country earned the money according to federal law, but so did the ones out of LA and New York and they get paid first to pay the ones out of the other countries who are never compared to a downgrade for less than an agency rate since 2007. So they're actually the top percentage that first five and seven years paid according to federal law. LA, New York, Texas, San Francisco, Chicago, Miami, Vegas, Tennessee, and Ford, Paris, Barcelona, and overseas. 20 year supermodel talent and producers who co-produce for life. So I sold my car because the Venmo and PayPal take two days to process. And so I had 4,500 in a bank account and the government supported me to park my car and it's insured, but they protected me. And then after two days being in my car, I got some water and went to the restroom at the Hilton. I added the 4,500 to my account and I only spent 1,400 and then 500. It's like 400 and 100 of food at a restaurant. And then less than 700 or 800. So I would have like 2200 in a bank account, but the same thing happened again. And so I told Hilton and they said they'd comp it. And so it's just pending, but you have to keep the money in a bank account because it charged the card and they're gonna comp it. But if for some reason that happens, the card is still activated, but they would have to have like another 5K in a bank account. They could have another bank account or it could be the same one, but they would have to have that in case that happens. So they just said it takes a few days to process, but they'd have to have gift cards. You can buy, most places allow the gift cards and you can buy Starbucks, you can buy CVS with gift cards. And then it's also Venmo, but it takes two days and Zelle works the best instantaneously.